the best Android emulator for a low-end PC, the topic on which I have already made several videos. However, I still receive comments on my videos like this. That's why in today's video, I will provide you an emulator that you can use to run Free Fire on your potato PC, even if you have only 1 GB of RAM, a single core processor, or no graphics card, you can still use this emulator. So, let's start the video. Before moving towards the installation process, let me share the specifications of my PC with you so that all your doubts can be cleared. As you can see, my PC has only 2 GB of RAM and a 2.40 GHz processor. Now, let's check the graphics card in my PC. Here you can see that my PC has a 64 MB Intel HD graphics card, which is not really suitable for any significant tasks. So, let's move on to the installation process now. The download link for this file will be available in the description below. Simply download it from there. Speaking of its size, it is 341 MB. You just need to right-click on it and choose Run as Administrator. After that, in a few seconds, an interface like this will appear in front of you. Now, you need to click on Custom, then click on Browses and select the directory for this emulator. After that, click on Install, and your installation will start. As you can see, our installation is complete. Now, you just need to click on the Start button. As soon as it launches, I will guide you through some important settings so that you can play Free Fire without any lag. As you can see, our emulator is launched without any errors. You might be experiencing a little lag, and that's because I am using a screen recorder. To adjust the settings, click on this button and go to Advanced Settings. Here, select Custom and set the CPU cores to the maximum. Now, in the RAM options, select 1400 MB. Then, go to Startup Settings, choose Mobile Phone, and leave the option below as OpenGL. After that, click on Save Settings and restart the emulator once. Here, my emulator has restarted, and at the same time, I have installed Free Fire. There are two ways to install it. You can click on this APK button and install it, or you can use Google Play Store. Let me quickly show you the gameplay. Also, in my previous video, a subscriber requested to see the performance in the task manager. Here you go. I fulfilled your request. If you have any other requests, feel free to let me know. The emulator is running smoothly on my PC, but if you still experience lag, I recommend trying a low-end Android operating system instead. If you want to watch a tutorial, click on the video on the left, and I'll see you in that video. Goodbye.